Hi everyone! Today we'll look at a new premium add-on of Wistify theme, the Smart Product Filter. It offers unlimited options so that your customers can filter by any and all criteria and find exactly what they're looking for. Such as attributes, ordering, date range. It also supports the range filter so you can apply to the different price range. The checkbox style is powerful as you can apply it to the category, taxonomy, and child taxonomy. The rating is flexible when you can set it from a 1 to 5 star rating. If you don't want to show all the taxonomies by a list you can put them into a select field like that. Smart Product Filter gives users the possibility to apply multiple filters. The faceted search system allows displaying specific and relevant options on the page. Moreover, all filters are AJAX powered and reload instantly, which is guaranteed smooth on page operation and enhanced user experience. In your dashboard, find Wistify Options page and click on the dashboard. Activate Smart Product Filter add-on and go to the setting page. In general section, you can show, set the layout as horizontal or vertical and index data. You must click index the button in the beginning. In style section, you can customize the detailed information of all types of filters, including color, text, and size. The step 3 is to add a new filter. Click on the add new filter button to create a new product filter for your store. And then give your product filter a name, select the filter label and type. After selecting type, a new drop down menu section appears. And it varies depending on the filter type you choose. In this example, I'm creating a visual filter, so it will show data source for you to choose from. Finally, publish the filter. Follow this process to add other filters as you want. Here are the product filters I have created. As you can see, each filter has its own shortcode. However, in this video, I will use the global shortcode to take all filters. Return to the setting page to copy the global shortcode of smart product filter. Then go to appearance, click in widgets. Finding the WooCommerce sidebar to paste the shortcode you have copied before in the text box. After that, click on the update button. Now, you can visit the shop page front end to check how product filters work in your store. And here is the process of how to set up a horizontal layout for product filter. Just return to the Smart Product Filter setting page, set the layout as horizontal and save it. Then take a look to check it. Your shop now looks quite clearly with the horizontal product filters. All their detailed filters are behind the drop down icons. In case the product filters are shown in both horizontal and vertical layouts in this process, you can go to the customizer head to layout and then sidebar. Set the shop slash product archive page to no sidebar to fix this issue. Remember to click publish button to save your change. Another configuration you can do with Wistify product filter add-on is to set up product filter with Elementor. In this method, you need to enable the Woo Builder add-on. In dashboard, click in Woo Builder to create a new shop page. Then, you can edit the new page with Elementor Page Builder. To create the product filter, you should find the Wustify products add-on and drag and drop it to the new template. Then you can do further customization to meet your requirement. Enable Active Filter button to help customers find out products more easily. Drop down to the Query section, you must select the current query option to make sure that you are applying 
the product filters you have created on this new shop page. Then you need to add other elements to your page such as a title, and short code. In the shortcode area, you place the Wustify Filter Global Shortcode to take out all filters. Once finishing, click on the Update button. Now, visit the shop page you have created with Woo Builder and Smart Product Filter. As you can see, the shop page works well with a horizontal filter layout. Now, I will show you how to add a vertical fiddler layout on a new page. You need a sidebar, so you have to spile your page into two section at least. Drop a product widget on one side. Paste the filter global shortcode here. And in the product section, enable active filter button, then choose the current query under the query section. Then update your change. However, this is not the final step. The last step is returning to the product filter setting page and turn the layout to vertical to make it sync with your customization. Now you can see if your new page works well with a vertical filter layout. The further process in this video is to optimize for mobile and tablet with Woo Builder. Go to the shop page you have made, choose Edit with Elementor to further customize it on mobile. Click on the devices icon at the bottom left, select mobile device, then the mobile interface appears in the middle of the editing page. You should take a look throughout the page and check all filters. If there is any filter, that does not look well on mobile, you should hide them on mobile and tablet. To make it appear on mobile interface, you should place the toggle slider at the top page. It will automatically take out the widget WooCommerce sidebar and product filter vertical layout. Then, you can do some settings with toggle slider. Basically, almost all settings are proper. But you should check all options and change any of them if needed. In here, I find that the filter button is not easy to see. So I will change the background and text color. Once finishing all changes, click the Update button. Now, you can check the shop page front end on mobile to see if it looks well. As you can see, my shop page works well on mobile screen. All product filters are hidden under the Fiddler button. Click on the Filter button to check if all filters look good on your site. Hopefully, this video helped you easily create smart product filters on your WooCommerce store. Check out the add-on details at wustify.com and the detailed documentation I put in the video description below. Thanks for watching.